Hi guys, so I haven't made a video in a while and I want to talk about everything, but today I just want to show you guys today is, what is today? October the 20th and I'm doing my pre-op diet. So um, I'm supposed to have, let's see if I can, yeah, clear dot, clear liquids. And so I can have water, sugar-free, crystal light. Um, soups, bouillon, fat-free soup, fat-free broth. Is that Kumon? Kumon, I'm not sure what that is. Um, fruit juices without pulp, apple, grape, and cranberry. I wish I had some grape and cranberry. I have apple juice that I'm drinking now. And then I have broth. And what I was doing was, it's actually not just broth. It's um, soup, strain, and then I added some broth to make it more filling and added the chicken noodle soup so it can have more um flavor and so if it's dark in here i don't have my overhead lights on and i just thought i'd just wing it with this and so gelatin i can have fruit ice gelatin popsicles without pulp i picked up some today um some clear hard candy and regular jello and then all these other things i can't have um so that's just like a outline of something if I want to eat so um I don't have to take any magnesium sulfate because um I am having the vertical sleeve versus the R and Y which is gastric bypass and um yeah so I'm trying to think what is this lemon and cherry drugstore DT I'm trying to think what that is. And nothing by mouth after midnight. Okay, guys. So, I'm just showing you some things that I picked up. So, this is what I actually had. Um, the chicken, homestyle chicken noodle soup. And what I did was I mixed it with some of the Rachel Ray. And then I strained it. So, yeah. That's what I did. And that's probably what I do afterwards. I did want to cook a whole chicken and make my own broth. And I still will. But um, I just got a lot of stuff to do tonight because I know some things I won't be able to do, like change my sheets and um, I want to go into Sai's room, straighten up his room. I need to do my hair. Just a lot of things and I had to work today too. I should have taken today off. But anyway, so I went to Vitamin Shop and I picked up some of this ice up here. And this stuff is really expensive. I heard it's really gross. But she said the blue is one that everybody likes to um pick up or they said it tastes the best and yeah so I think this is blue raspberry yeah so um it's straight protein this protein drink zero zero carbs you can see it there and um yeah so it has like 40 grams of protein in it and it's probably why it's so disgusting <laughs> so I just picked up one of those it's 4.49 a bottle my husband was like what so let me show you what else I picked up Okay, guys, so this is just some of the stuff that I picked up. I feel like I'm leaving out a lot of stuff that I picked up, but I picked up some Premier Protein. I did not get the um, really big case because that would just give me an excuse to just go out to the store and get some walking done, and hopefully I'll feel better. I heard a lot of people say that um, they bought a whole lot of something didn't like it or didn't agree with them or they bought a whole lot of something thinking they were going to be like shut in and not be able to go out so i just picked up four if not i can send my husband to the store to get more and plus i'll be drinking only like two ounces at a time even though it'll be around the clock um i shouldn't go through that super fast because i'll be drinking other drinks as well okay sorry i'm not paying attention to what i'm doing Okay, I picked up, I showed this in, I think, another haul, um, the pre-op, but this is going to be post-op. Um, these are just some samples that they still gave, that they gave me, um, my healthcare provider, Glucerna, and Insure. And I compared the grams to this versus the Premier Protein, and it's not as much. So what they also said was that you can take injury here and um, put it inside of your drink and add more protein that way. I have to remember the amount of protein you should get a day. I think it's 60 to 90. I don't know, guys. I am going to have to look that up and then caption it below because I need to remember that. 
Okay, so I got some sugar-free Jello. I didn't pick up a lot of this. I don't know why I picked up pudding. I probably can have that later, later on. I think I'm mistaken. I should have got more sugar-free Jello. But I just got a little bit of that. They may be my might be my favorite. I don't know, but I really don't care for Jello, so that's why I only picked up one. I have I don't know if I can have the Diet Snapple be raspberry tea because it may have caffeine in it. So I may have to just let somebody, the boys or somebody, drink that. But I have the Fit and Active Fruit Punch. The lemonade already opened some, but Jason bought me some more today. I think it was wild strawberry because he started drinking mine. Um, the Swanson, Swanson Natural Goodness Broth with 33% less sodium. I'm not sure if the Rachel Ray is less sodium. Oh, yeah, it is. I thought so. So I picked hers up because I like the ingredients on the side. You know, you can pronounce everything. <laughs> and so... I thought I would get that, and then I got this. It was like two thirteen at Walmart, and this was like one seventy four. And then I have these little cups. I picked these up a while ago from Dollar Tree. I probably should have been getting more, but um, I have quite many up there. And I'm trying to think what else, guys. Let me look and see what I can have as a modified liquid diet. What are you doing, Saya? So my modified liquid diet. Um, 64 ounces daily make sure that you can that's a lot of water then protein shakes yeah 60 to 80 grams of protein calories 500 to 600 calories a day um hydrate hydration fluids water non-carbonated decaf or low calorie um drinks water crystal light sugar free kool-aid wilders drink mix Mayo Dasani liquid flavor enhancer. I don't think I showed you guys that, but I picked some up from Aldi. Um, clear juice diluted 50 50. So I can have like apple juice, but it has to be like half water, half juice, no more than six ounces of juice a day. Um, no calorie flavored waters. I want to go and get some of that later. Some G2 Gatorade. I have that sugar free popsicles. Oh, I picked those up. So let me show you guys that. Um, they were like $3 and something. Some broth, strain, low fat soup. I would like to look at the other options of those other than just chicken noodle. And low sodium tomato juice, V8, no splash. I don't know if I'm going to even um, get that because I don't really like um, tomato juice or V8. And substitute sugar. So if I want decaffeinated tea, I can use Trivia or Stevia. So I need flavored water. I don't have that. Um, check out the low-fat soups and the Trivia and or Stevia and decaffeinated tea. Did I say that already? I think I did. Okay. Then the meal replacement. I will just, you can stop the video if you want to look at the different shakes. Um, or protein isolate powder mixes so I haven't decided which one of these that I want to order yet or try I will pick up some fair life skin milk that can be found at Target maybe at Walmart just say it don't say that that's not nice and of course the premier protein I will get some at Costco um, they have caramel strawberry vanilla and chocolate um, there's the isopure celebrate bariatric advantage shakes those can be ordered or I can go to that bariatric store that I showed um, in the last video that I did months ago and yeah guys so let me show you some things I'm taking to the hospital So I had to work today so I'm trying to get everything together and um, I have to look over my list of things that they recommend to take to the hospital I thought for sure I had one of these I hate to pay a dollar 47 because I know these are a dollar at Dollar Tree I think they're 97 cents at Target or something like that but I wanted to make sure I had one so my breath will be fresh I just picked these up because I was in Dollar Tree and I said well try those wipes um, on the bariatric Facebook group page they recommended that you have someone 
to wipe down like the doorknobs, the railings and stuff like that. Cause you're gonna have to get up and walk like, I think like four hours after you're in the hospital, after they bring you back to your room. So I picked this up. So I won't be risked for no infections or anything. And then I just wanted to have it. So I picked it up from Dollar Tree. I went to Walmart and picked me up one of these satin bonnets, stay on satin bonnets. And I thought I'd try the brown instead of black. They had different colors, but I didn't want a bright color. I normally like bright colors. I also picked up some of this um, Sure Sense Apple Cinnamon Spray. Someone's always going to the bathroom blowing it up. Um, if somebody has surgery, whereas my mom, not my, yeah, my mom had surgery, I remember. Um, my brother, if I had Josiah something somebody's always going to the bathroom blowing it up or somebody one of my kids got gas so that's why i picked up some air freshener and that's it i have some other stuff up here but that's it um you do okay guys so i'm gonna record what i'm taking to the hospital i don't need much um according to the facebook bariatric group i asked some what I should bring and it was frequently asked questions link that she had and I think I have everything so um okay so I have my charger not my charger my CPAP machine and it's kind of dark in here because I'm in my room and I'm gonna wear this dress I haven't wore this dress when I'm discharged and I wanted to wear the dress because I didn't want something with elastic because they said that could bother you and then I have these shoes let's see it's dark and have the these shoes here and I'm gonna wear those or either my house shoes some flats on the way home I have some disinfectant wipes some air freshener I think my boys are gonna stay here I don't think they're gonna go come up to the hospital because I'm not gonna be there that long so I think I'm gonna take the pumpkin with me or either the apple um, some of these Snuggadoo shoes from Dollar Tree with the skids on the bottom. Probably just to keep my feet warm. They will have shoes, but I just bring them anyway. I know they're a slip hazard, so I might can't wear those. Um, I have my charger for my phone. Some hair lotion for my hair. Um, just some spray afterwards. When you go to the hospital, you're not supposed to wear deodorant or lotion so if you see my hands and they're ashy i have my flat iron so when i go home i won't be doing my hair today or only when i go home maybe probably won't feel like it some combs some vitamin e oil if my hair is dry i have um a satin bonnet some wipes if i need um, of course, I'm going to need to go to the bathroom, but just some wipes. I thought that would be easier. Some nighttime clean, cleansing towelettes. I probably just need a few of these, but i just keep it in the um, container. Those came from Dollar Tree. A Reach toothbrush. I picked this up from Walmart, but Dollar Tree has them as well. But I don't have time to go by there. And the Deep Action Cleansing Towelettes. So I can wipe my face. In here, I have some sanitizer and some deodorant. I can't wear none now. And some lip balm, but I I will have my purse as well, so I have plenty in there. And I will be bringing some robes. Hi guys, so I went to Walmart today to get some medicine or some yeah, some medicine items that I needed and also some items to get ready for the pureed stage. I'm feeling kind of not myself today. Yesterday I was fine. Um, just a little dizzy. I probably need to drink more fluids. And so I'm sipping, sipping, sipping. And I just wanted to share the pureed stage. What's the matter, Saya? Um, the pureed stage. I'm not in there yet, but I am ready um mentally but probably physically i'm not there yet i want to wait at least two weeks or until they tell me to um no i think they're going to tell me to i call my nutritionist but i'm just so over liquids
Will you close this? Thank you. Okay, so what I picked up today, I spent about $50, which I'm like, what in the world? But I guess it was the medication here. I needed some stool softener. The stool softener I had was old. Um, some Tylenol, the off-brand Equate. Uh, PM, I picked this up because the hydrocortone cortisone or cord cord cordone um, actually helped me sleep at night and I'm really tolerable of pain so I really didn't need it I was asking her because I you know when I did toss and turn my stomach was sore and seemed like as days went on my stomach what got sore but actually I just took the Tylenol today um, two of the 500 and I'm fine so um, nothing I had three c-sections so I should be fine with my belly okay um so then i also needed some more tylenol so i picked up the equate brand this was about five dollars um i think this was two dollars the pm so this will help me sleep stool softener um uh oh i have not had a bowel movement almost in seven days sorry it's tmi go give it to jj okay Sorry guys, um, almost in seven days, so um, I think a week or ten days, you're supposed to let them know. So she told me to um, get some x -Lax. I did get the Walmart brand, this was $5, they have one a little taller, um, it's seven, and then they have one bigger than that, it's nine, and I didn't get, not x -Lax, Miralax, and this is called the Clear Lax, so it says compare to Miralax, so I'll mix this in some water. I also picked up some pink lemonade Wilders light. I really like the lemonade. It helps me get the water down. I, first, all I wanted was water. But now, um, I need some kind of flavor with it um, to get it down. I picked up some more of the chicken sausage gumbo. I usually have this for dinner. And I strain everything off and I just have the juice. I also picked up some sharp, finely shredded sharp cheddar cheese, and I will put the link to that video, not video, the link to that website below, and I'm going to make some potato soup. So this is the um, Idaho Buttery Home Style Mashed Potato Soup, I mean mashed potatoes, and I'm going to add chicken broth to that. So I picked up two of those, and the broth here, and add some cheese to that. Then I also picked up, I remember my little brother, when he had his, we were walking by and they had this micro mug and so I saw it for myself as well. This is by Campbell's and I know Dollar Tree has one, but I wanted a really good quality one and you know, if you don't get it right then a Dollar Tree is gone. So this was $4.50. I picked up two of the sweet potatoes to make like a pureed sweet potato. I also picked up the Sam's Choice Chicken Tortilla Soup with Lime. So I'm going to strain that. And what I've been doing, if I don't use all the juice, my husband tried to get on me about that. And I was like, I oh, know. But I've been putting it in a coffee cup, a Dollar Tree white coffee cup with the colors. Or um, a bowl and keep the juice or keep the rice or whatever stuff that's in it all the vegetables to keep its flavor so when I come back and want more later okay um, I love the caramel premier protein I really like this more so than the chocolate there's the other chicken sausage gumbo um, I picked up the loaded potato with bacon I don't know what this tastes like but I figured that I would just have it for convenience I do have some potatoes and I probably can make my own but I don't know, just have it for convenience if I just want something really quick. Some Pintos, they do on that website as well have where you can emulsify it and I guess doctor it up, fix it up, and make some um, pureed Pinto beans. Some hearty pot pie style. I saw on their bariatric site as well where they had some pot pie that you can have later on. Um, so I just saw the soup and I just said I'll pick it up and then also the parmesan grated cheese the Walmart brand I picked that up to put in probably the mashed potatoes or a soup or something so that's all I picked up today guys um 
yeah i walked in walmart i felt a little um disoriented if i go too fast if i turn my head too fast i feel like i'm dizzy i didn't get in the cart which i normally do but i just wanted to walk because i really haven't um I do get up a lot because I have to go after Josiah and get stuff and walk to the kitchen and do stuff still. But um, I wanted to like walk a little bit more just to get my body moving. So, but anyway, overall, I'm doing great. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.